I think the regional conference has been of enormous value. Um, it's brought together a group of people who um, haven't met for a long time to discuss leadership, which is vital uh, in schools. Um, the, the consequences of this um, are, are enormous. There's a, a lovely camaraderie between the people involved. They've got to know each other in a much better way. They've spent five days discussing, discussing different aspects of leadership and um, having very rich conversations to both deepen and challenge each other's understandings of uh, leadership and educational leadership, of course. We know that in schools you won't get improved learning progress and achievement for children without quality leadership and um, that's been of enormous benefit. There's lots of discussions about where to next. There's a great um, opportunity here to, uh, to work collaboratively across multiple nations uh, and that's very powerful when the nations um, collaborate. Uh, and offers um, real opportunity to have a very, uh, a really a quality product which is going to have impact on generations to come. I think the, the standards were, the standards are written in 2009 and I think a lot has changed since then but the standards were in a very good position, they were well written in 2009 before they were ratified by the ministers. Um, this has been an opportunity to look at um, really calling out some of the improvements that could be made. Um, I'm a passionate believer in um, instructional leadership and that the leader's focus has got to be on teaching and learning. And uh, I think that's been called out beautifully by looking at the pillar on teaching and learning and calling it instructional leadership. I think uh, um, people have worked really well into making changes for um, management, uh, changes to community, thinking broadly about uh, some of the issues that were not an or things that weren't an issue, um, you know, 14 years ago that have become important now. And I think as groups working together uh, to look at each of those uh, domains, they have really brought together a lot of uh, best practice and have written that into the expectations for what leaders should be doing uh, uh, to improve the quality of leadership. Uh, and therefore the quality of student progress and achievement across the region.